Hey folks, welcome back to The Restaurant Show. If you're somebody like me, you loved baked goods. For better or for worse, you loved baked goods. If that's you, you'll want to stick around here today because we're talking uh, to somebody from uh, not your average ordinary bakery. This is Michelle Claussen from Claussen's European Bakery in Hi. Middleton. How are you, Michelle? Good, how are you? Very good. Sorry about stumbling through that intro there. Oh, it's okay. A little bit better, but <laughs> no. But, uh, you know, you, I think the food will make up for this because you truly have authentic European baked goods. You were trained over in Germany. You know what you're doing. And these are things that you really, they're hard to find in this area, like truly these authentic oh, yeah. different recipes. Yes. So, uh, but let's, enough talk. Let's get started. What are you making for us today? Um, tonight we're making, or tonight. See, today, I can't tonight, talk either. <laughs> yeah, it's want. whatever this it is. This morning. We're doing... Uh, French buttercream tort. It's an amaretto apple cider tort. Oh wow! All right, yes. you have my attention. Okay. Yes. So what's the what's the process here? Um, You've already got some things. Yeah, it's out three layers of cake. Okay. Um, and that's just white cake then. That's yellow. Okay. Yeah, yellow, yellow cake. white. Okay. Same thing. Okay. Um, and then we do. We're going to layer this. Um, right. I can get started and let's, tell you what I'm doing. Let's do it. Let's okay. This is um, amar amaretto. Okay. We call it LZ, which is Leuterzucker in German. Which means Don't ask me to it's that. Um, God, what do you call that? Sugar. Okay. It's cooked sugar. There's cooked a there's sugar. a different American word for it. We call it LZ Leuterzucker. Okay. All right. Leuterzucker. Did yeah. I say that right? Yeah. So it, it's it's boiled down sugar with water. So. Gotcha. It's been condensed. Is that similar um, to like a simple oops. syrup type of thing? Yes, or? that's what it is. Simple syrup. See, okay, I I know. <laughs> Okay, that was French buttercream. Okay, French buttercream. And we have some apples that we're going to put on here. And what makes, I mean, I'm, I'm looking at the consistency of that. It does, when you say French buttercream, it mm -hmm. does look a little bit different from like the conventional buttercream that yes. I might see. So what's the difference exactly? French buttercream is made with whole eggs and... Don't worry about the tablecloth. Okay, and you heat them up to a certain temperature. Okay. Um, I always say blood warm, so... Okay. Like, and then you put sugar in there, and then you whip them up. You whip them up to get them cold. Okay. Um, and that gives them volume. Gotcha. Um, kind of like a custard. That's what it's like. Yeah, it's like a it custard kind of, buttercream. Kind of like a custard. Exactly. It's a, it's a good way to describe it for sure. All right, so we get another layer of the, another layer of buttercream. Yeah, it's it's um, surprisingly thick. Is that cold right now, or has that been in room temperature? No, for a while? it's been at room temperature for a while. It's surprisingly like just very thick looking. It is. Yeah. This is coming yes. from somebody who's so, helped to make custardy. Of cakes. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then it's whipped up with butter, so that's hence the buttercream. Okay. Of course. Part, yeah. yeah. Yep. But the stabilizer is the eggs. Gotcha. gotcha. Uh, there we go. So not too many of the apples, but just enough to kind of make a yeah. nice even layer on top there. Mm -hmm. That looks good. And the the amaretto's that's kind of the important yep. part. <laughs> Gives it the flavor. Of course. Of course. So then we have another layer of that. So uh, mm -hmm. while you're uh, finishing that up for us, um, believe it or not, fall is just around the corner. Yeah. I hope I don't get egged in the street by saying that. But, uh, it is around the corner. It is around the yes. corner. So tell us a little bit about what's happening at Clausen's this fall. Um, fall time is when we convert, shift our menus over. Okay. This looks like the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Um, tower of cakes, though. Whoops. That's okay. It's we so ship. <laughs> so that's when we go to more apple things, um, use more nuts, hazelnuts, yeah. um, bacon. Not in torts, but in our <laughs> you don't quiche. Have no, butternut squash quiche. Okay. Um, apple pecan bread. Pumpkin flavored stuff. I'm pumpkin like. spice. We yes. do pumpkin spice cookies, cupcakes, yes. uh, caramel apples. And, and typically, I'm just kind of curious, when uh, when people are, I mean, obviously, because people can place orders, yes. they can walk into the, the bakery uh, and, you know, get something to, uh, you know, that's already pre-made, or mm -hmm. they can uh, order something, uh, have something that's yeah. made to order. What are some of the events that people in the fall are typically ordering some of your stuff for? Um, tailgate parties. Okay. Uh, I don't know what else. <laughs> tailgate. I don't know tailgate, tailgate parties. Tailgate and tailgate. It's so. Wisconsin, yeah. so... Tailgate parties. Tailgate okay. Parties. But if you have any, if you you know, some people want to do fall weddings, I'm sure. You oh yeah. Have fall weddings and um, I don't know. Any, anything Back for to like school. Thanksgiving or Halloween oh yeah, parties Thanksgiving like definitely. That? Halloween parties not so much. Really? Okay. Um, I think Hallow Halloween um, is more of a candy season. Sure. And when I say candy, I mean 
like the grocery store, you sure. know, the bigger bags of candy. Sure. Um, the since, Tootsie Rolls and that. Yeah, since you can't give kids popcorn balls and right. homemade things homemade any anymore. Anyway. Yeah. Sorry, I'm messing up your entire table. No, that's table. fine. You got. You can't make a cake without uh, spilling a few nuts. So. That's right. <laughs> it's all about the nuts. Look at too. that. It's beautiful. I'm gonna put it here. You're gonna put it right there. Because right. I don't Sounds trust good. myself. Okay. Fantastic. And that's it? Um, no, it's not that's it. That's not it. We, okay. are, we are almost there. <laughs> okay. As you can see, I'm a little bit excited to try I am it. too. Here, I have so. not tried this cake. Okay. So I'm supposed to put apple in the middle. Oh, I see. Yeah. Right. And then do you kind of... Here, I'm going to let you... You're going to sprinkle this on the apple. Oh, this is cinnamon sugar. Mm. Uh -huh. Love that smell. Yeah. And then I'm going to put a little bead of buttercream around that. Okay. To finish it off. Sure. <clears throat> it's amazing when you, um, you know, you can be somewhat of a, when it comes to frosting or icing a cake, you can be a pretty mediocre cake icer. But if you know how to do stuff like this, that really uh -huh. kind of can cover up some of those things. So. Oh, yeah. You have no <laughs> idea. <laughs> Yeah, frosting and chocolate covers up sure. a lot of baking sins. Yeah, a lot of sins, for sure. Yeah. Okay. That's looking real good. good. I'm going to go over here. So okay. That's, that space, that's all right with you. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Coming together. Then you can do the cinnamon sugar in the middle if you want. And that you just... That looks fantastic. Sprinkle on. So, yeah. Evenly kind of around the whole. Yeah. So I got a nice little ball right there. That, that looks nice. great. That's good right there. All right. Yeah. And we have a knife somewhere, right? Didn't we grab a knife? We did. There's it's it. right here. Fantastic. Well, I'm going to cut into this. Yes. Uh, unfortunately, we are out of time already, so the viewers at home won't get a chance to see me try this, but I'm really excited about this. Michelle, always a pleasure to have you on our program. Thank you so much for coming on today. My hands are a mess. That's Thank okay. you. So are mine. Don't go away. There's more restaurant show coming up after the break, so stick around.